that's pretty close to the ice cream freezer refrigerator. How can I visually detect if a copy of the witness is pirated? Um, so what I was referring to back at that time was there was one very specific pirated copy that had a very obvious mistake in it that we were seeing people play on Twitch. And what that mistake was, here's the deal. Here's, here's what, I've explained this before, but here's what fucking happened. So the first pirated copy of the game to hit Pirate Bay and related sites was uh, done by some Chinese, uh, whatever you want to call them, pirates, right? And I guess they didn't like the thing, like when we start up, when we decide what language to display in, uh, we like ask the operating system or Steam or the both. I don't know. They didn't like that. And so in addition to cracking the game, they hard coded the language to Chinese, right? And, and that was the copy that went up all over the internet first. And then people wanted to, some other pirates, I guess, wanted to make an English version of the game, right? And instead of like re-cracking it themselves, they took the one the Chinese pirates had did and unhard coded the language from Chinese. <laughs> all right. So, so then this was on the Pirate Bay and this is the one that all the English language and European language speaking people were using. Um, except they didn't unhard code it because they weren't hackers enough to know how to change the code. All right. So they didn't actually go undo the code thing that the Chinese hackers had done. They went in and just swapped out the font files and the text files for the Chinese version with the English version, and it displayed English and it was fine, right? But little did they know, in the game, right, when we draw the subtitles, we have to decide, you know, how, how high how, how far apart are the subtitles from each other vertically? Like what looks good? And in Chinese, that is uh, um, hard-coded to be, like if we're using a Chinese font, just the way the font metrics came out and stuff, we said, well, it's a certain amount times the maximum character height. And in a Chinese font where the characters are mostly blocky and consistently sized, the, the max height of a character is not that, far from like the typical height of a character, right? On the other hand, the English font that we were using, the max height of the character is way higher than the average height. And in fact, in some of these fonts, the max height like represents some totally broken character that you would never use anyway. And so because we just knew what font we were using for those languages when we were using that font, it's a lower multiple. And so what happened is this cracked copy went out where it, the code thought it was rendering in Chinese, but the data files were switched to English. So the subtitle lines were way too fucking far apart. They were like a large multiple of the character height. Um, and of course, anytime a streamer or somebody was playing with that copy of the game, it was instantly recognizable if they were playing with subtitles. Because you see them and the subtitles take up like the entire fucking bottom half of the screen vertically. And it was so funny because the first time I saw it, I was like, what the fuck is going on? Do we have some horrible bug in the game? And it was like, nope, nope. I see what happened. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, you know, some, some streamers who had fairly large audiences like they could afford the game, we're playing a pirated copy of the game. Let me just say that. <laughs>